All right, people. Happy Saturday. How are we doing out there today? And once you see, I got long sleeves on because the weather is getting cold. And I hate to say this, but I'm going to say it with a passion. I dislike the cold. Spring, you to come back. ASAP, pronto, affirmative. Now, I could never fall, but the winter, I don't like it. But it is what it is. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you stay tuned at the very end of the very video. Happy Saturday. How are we all doing out there today? Hope you're all having a one, excuse me, I hope you're all having a wonderful, tremendous Saturday. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, you already know what to do, but I must say this. The video is not going to be for long because you know how my weekends is. So, this going to be a little bit short video, so stay tuned with me, all right? But yeah, folks, I hope you all enjoyed this very topic. But for all my true supporters, my real, real, real true supporters, y'all going to enjoy this topic because I'm going to rub my hands like Birdman. You probably said, Brian, what the hell are you talking about? Well, you're about to find out in this topic, so... Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and once again, stay tuned, folks, because you don't want to miss out. Don't touch that dial, all right? Because we're about to drop some major facts and major bombs in this video. Y'all know how we do. We finna shut it down. But yeah, here we go with the top of ladies and gentlemen. Lights, camera, action. Your spirit made an example out of your enemies. They are starting to put some respect on your name. R-E-S-P-C-T. Aretha Franklin. Rest in peace. But your spirit got people so intimidated. They are putting respect on your name as we speak. You probably wondering, why are you scaring the living daylights out of people? And you're not even being a bully. You're not walking around here acting like you Debo. Or you the biggest dude on the block. Or you that guy. Or you that woman. But folks, it's not that. It's your spirit. People look at you like you get ready to beat them up or something. But no. They see that your spirit is not going to tolerate no BS. You too as well. But literally, it's your spirit. That's why when people come near you or be near your presence, they're scared to say something to you. Having them scared to say, hey, how you doing? They just put their head down. Or they put their head down and speak, hey, how you doing? Oh, oh, all right, all right. And stay looking you in the face, man to man, woman to woman, in the flesh. She put her head down, ladies. Girl, how you doing? All right, all right. How you doing? They scared of your spirit. But they were tossed smack behind your back when your back is turned. But face to face, they respect you. Because once again, they see you as this spiritual leader. You are nothing to be played with. And your enemies are starting to witness that. Because every trap they try to put you in, you end up outsmarting them and you escape all the lies and the traps. That's why they're afraid of you because they know it may be 20 of them, 30, 40, 50, 100. I can care less what that amount is. You are one man by yourself, one woman by yourself, but spiritually, you got your own spiritual clique. You got your ancestors. You got guardian angels, your loved ones that had transitioned, and on top of that, you got the most high God. That's a spiritual click right there. These people don't want no problems with y'all. That's why they are intimidated. You literally scare people. Imagine you go to Walmart or a grocery store, and you look this person in the eye, they look you in the eye. And they already see what type of spirit that you're carrying. Then as soon as you get your food, ring it up and blah, blah, blah. 
They give you the receipt and the change. Their hands are shaking. Had that happened to you before, ladies and gentlemen? Somebody gave you the change and the receipt. Their hands are shaking. You be like, what is wrong with this dude? What's wrong with her? It's that spirit. Well, yeah, that spirit too. Because that spirit is afraid of your spirit. And you be wondering what is going on. You be thinking they on that stuff, but no. They sent your spirit. When you walked into that grocery store, all of them did. And when people be afraid of you, that lets you know right there, they're not living right. Because why do you be afraid of somebody or be intimidated? Maybe because y'all too weird for these folks. Maybe because your spirit, who knows, the way you carry yourself. You got so much resilient. And you know today's society, you got weak son of a guns out here. Because they're too busy to listening to today's society. Yap, 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 yap. Have you noticed? The ones that do a lot of talking be the weakest. But the quietest one in the room be the loudest and the strongest. And your spirit is telling these folks, don't F with me. Don't F with him. Don't F with her. They know what's up. That's why they're intimidated. And your spirit is spiritually checking them. Your spirit is saying, don't get it twisted. Don't wake up the beast. Not Brock Lesnar, but the spiritual beast. <laughs> but folks, y'all got people so intimidated. Y'all got these folks shaking. They're scared to talk. They voice starts shaking. <laughs> How you doing, sir? How you doing, ma'am? Uh, okay. They're scared to speak to you. Then when they say something to you, they get tongue-tied. Y'all yeah, remember Mush Mouth from Fat Albert, right? How, how, how you doing? Your spirit got these folks speechless. Got them stuttering, pokey pig wise. E -e 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 how you doing? Y'all yeah, ain't did nothing to these folks. But on their end, they try to hurt y'all. And every time they try to hurt you, it didn't work. So guess what? They end up hurting their own selves. Now, this is why they respecting you. Uh, I might not like him. I might not like her. But guess what? I, I, I respect him. I, I, they, they, they got a stutter. I, 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 they stutter so bad, they eyes start blinking. I, 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 I respect him. I, I respect her. No disrespect to the people that do stutter, but... Y'all spirit got them stuttering, speechless, hands shaking, everything is shaking. They can't control it unless they shake that devilish spirit off of them. But some of them are afraid to step out that comfort zone. And ever since you step out of your comfort zone, it scares people. Y'all are frightening people. But I don't know what the problem is. But they know not to deal with you. They know not to say nothing wrong to you. Because if you wanted to, you could give it to them. You could let them have it. You could easily hurt their feelings. Get gangster on them. But you're not finna scoot down to their level. Because that's exactly what they want you to do. But they don't want that smoke. Charlotte, they don't want no problems with you. Tell them, ladies. Shawty, you don't want no problems. Fellas tell them, you don't want no problems, man. But nah, y'all not about that life. You come with peace, joy, and happiness. But they want to cause problems with you. But that spirit is checking them. It's telling them right now, turn your behind around. Don't even think about it. Then when they get close to you, that's what happens. Or they put their head down. Either the two, they're scared to say something. They all they act all big and tough when your back is turned. 
but get right near their presence. How, how you doing, sir? How, how you doing, girl? Uh, all right, all right. They can't talk that. Excuse me, they can't talk that talk now. All of your enemies, naysayers, doubters, I don't care who they are. They know that you're the real deal. They know that you are the Uno. These people know y'all are nothing to be played with. This is why people are so intimidated. But the, but to the ones that are intimidated, they're not living right. Think about it. Why would you be intimidated by a real person that keep it real and say it like it is? Because they are living a lie. They would have heard the lie than the truth. Tell them the truth and it hurts. Hey, the truth hurts. But guess what? It sets you free, man. But see, they don't understand that. They would rather tell lies or hear a lie. But some folks, tell me the truth. When you tell them the truth, they can't take it. Because they can't handle the truth. The truth hurt weak people. But well, people like y'all... Y'all are the truth. The truth is in your DNA. The truth run through your blood. You got that truthful spirit. And the people that live in a lie, y'all offending them. Your spirit offends a lot of people. But you don't even care. You can care less. Because you was not put here on this earth to hang with the crowd or to have a connection with the crowd because that's what society wants you to do these days be weak be controlled be a butt kisser but all my weird ones out there y'all know y'all know y'all not finna do that but i will say this they will hate you and respect you at the same doggone time What Aria Franklin said once again, R-E-E-S-P-C-T. Find out what it means to me. Take care of TCP. And like Birdman said in that interview, put some respect on my name. I ain't gonna say it no more. But y'all ain't even gotta say nothing. Your spirit is saying it for you. That's why they all being nice. Now they speaking. Like this, head down. They can't look you in the eye. They got to put their head down. Hey, brother, how you doing? Or they look at you. You're going to be a quick step. Hey, how you doing? All right. Now, tell me if I'm lying. Because this is based on a true story. Once again, this is major facts. Major bomb explode. Explosive, explosive, explosive. I'm telling you all right now. These people are so afraid of you. They act like you the boogeyman, Jason Michael Miles or somebody. But like kid and play, you ain't gonna hurt nobody. You won't even hurt a flower on the wall. You won't even kill a flower with a sledgehammer because y'all are so genuine. But once again, your spirit offends the weak ones. The weakest links. <laughs> but no, seriously, it does. This is why people run away from you. Weak people, that is. Fake people. That's why they scatter like roaches. But the real ones, they will not be intimidated by you. Because they will understand where you are coming from. So people be able if people be intimidated by you or be afraid, they let you know right there. They ain't living right and their spirit ain't right. And some ain't right about them either. Now tell me if I'm lying again. Nope. Because that's a true story. Y'all spirit got them offended. But who the Sam hell cares? But society these days Got people thinking out they behinds. 
got them saying stupid stuff. They must not hear the thing before you act. But when they see you do it, oh, they offended. Oh, they intimidated. They speeches, they can't talk now. You got that mean mugging, but they don't have to say nothing to you, though. They roll their eyes. <laughs> they turn their nose up. All these childish things. Because you are the truth. Ain't no doubt about y'all. Y'all are the truth. Capital T, the truth. The truth will always prevail. What's been done in the dark, it will show be revealed to the light. So anything they said about y'all or try to do to you behind the scenes is being revealed. And now they all guilty. Now they want to put some respect on your name. Now they want to act all friendly. Now they want to shake your hand or open doors for you. Like you King Cut. I said King Cut. Like you King Tut or somebody. Hey, here you go, sir. Hey, here you go, ma'am. They open up the door like you, uh, what's her name, that passed away years ago? Ladies, y'all got them opening doors for you like you pr Princess Diane or somebody. Fellas, you got them opening doors for you like you that guy from the movie Coming to America. Look, they got those roses out. Open doors for you. Like you're doing too much. But that's how much they respect you, though. This competition stuff, you beat them at their own game. By winning and it knowing them. Huh? Somebody said holler one time. But here they are gonna throw flowers. Open doors. Here you go, sir. Here you go, madam. Like chill. Ladies, you said chill. I ain't Princess Diane. Fellas, you said chill. I ain't King Tut or nobody. Chill. But once again, that spirit, your spirit is the truth. And them, well, we're not going to focus on them. We're going to focus on us because we are winning. And we ain't going to start winning for nobody. Whatever they like it or not, we're going to continue to win regardless. Keep on speaking the truth. Keep on doing what y'all doing. And y'all don't, and you know, you don't care who you offend. But guess what? They respect your hustle. They respect your work ethic. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Why are they so scared? But what we don't know, we, we don't care. But that intimidation. It's not going to stop you from winning. Keep on shining your light. I don't care if it make them afraid. I don't care if you scare the pants out of them. Keep shining your light. They can easily just turn away. But your spirit is so precious. They can't stop stirring. And if these people have a crush on you, they know doggone well. They ain't got a chance with you. Because you will reject them in a heartbeat. And I don't blame you. No, thank you. Next. Only the real ones can deal with us. No BS people. Ain't no half stepping. Like Big Daddy Kane would say. Ain't no half stepping. If they want to be with us, they got to step up to the plate. Because our spirit can sense fakeness. That's why we intimidate them, ladies and gentlemen. But yeah, folks, I'm going to wrap that one up. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. I am rooting for you all. And remember, don't give up. I love you all. God bless. Happy Saturday. And you will see me tomorrow. Salute.